opportunities to do wonderful deals like this. It will become the Berkshire brand. I mean, the first year or so, people will wonder about it, but the, but the person that follows me will bring the same qualities, including the ability to write a very big check, but other things besides that. And it, it, will, be the, uh, it will be a Berkshire brand that, uh, that may have started with me, but, but that will continue. Uh, going on to our Brazilian friends, uh, they're very smart, they're very focused, uh, they're very hardworking and determined, they're never satisfied, and uh, as I said earlier, uh, when you make a deal with them, you've made a deal with them. They don't overreach, they don't overpromise. Uh, they've got a lot of good qualities, and uh, um, if you read the book, uh, I think you probably learn a lot more about the qualities that made them what they are, but uh, we are very fortunate to be associated with them, and we're very fortunate to be associated with the, a number of the managers that have joined us, too. We, uh, we, we want to be a good partner ourselves because it, it attracts good partners, and and that is a reputation that Berkshire deserves. I mean, Charlie and I do our part toward, toward keeping that reputation intact, but that takes a lot of other people uh, also uh, behaving uh, in a way that causes people to want to join them, causes people to want to trust them, and uh, that will be part of a Berkshire brand. Charlie? Yeah, I always say the way to get a good spouse is to deserve one. And the way to get a good what's, partner... What's your second way? <laughs> and the other... Well, but to get a good partner, you, you deserve a good partner. It's an old-fashioned way of getting ahead. And the interesting about it is it still works in these modern times. Nothing changes. If you just, if you just behave yourself correctly... It's amazing how well it works. Do you have any further thoughts on the Brazilians? On what? On, on the success of Georgie Paulo and his associates uh, beyond what I laid out. Well, they, they're, you can't skirt the fact that they're very good at removing unnecessary costs. Sure. And I do not consider that in any way immoral or wrong or something. No, the I think removing unnecessary costs is a service to civilization. And I think it should be done with some, uh, what do I call it, mercy, really. Sensitivity. Sensitivity, but I, uh, I, I don't think it's good for our system to have a lot of make work and what have you. If it was, so, we'd love government, right? <laughs> yeah. And so... <laughs> Generally speaking, I think they're an interesting example to all of us. Yeah, we're learning from them. Everybody is. Okay. Some, some reluctantly. <laughs> Seven years ago.